Hey YouTube, I've uh, got another little uh, Necron bit of goodness for you. So I finally got around to finishing my Annihilation Barge. Now the original plan for this uh, was to do a step by step build like or similar to what I did with the Destruction, uh, the Doomsday Arc. But I got a little bit carried away with the build and before I knew it, it was pretty much done. I also needed to have it done for a game, so uh, when I get around to doing my command barge for my Anrakir the Traveller, I'll do one for you then, don't worry. So let me pop this off the base and show you what we got. Got the uh, arcing scythes, crescent shapes, very necrony at the moment. Uh, the whole kit sprayed black on the sprue, dry brushed with uh, bolt gun metal just to give it a little bit of... Uh, a little bit of an effect across there, but still leave some patches showing through just so it's not a very uniform colour, and I quite like the way that comes out. Picked out the circuitry in Goblin Green, which I think looks uh, pretty cool. Got your pilots in there working on their console, and of course the Tesla Destructor on the top there which I went on a little bit with the airbrush. Um, all the Gauss weaponry and stuff for the Necrons that I've done as greens, got the green rods, the green tape, and I, think, I thought for the Tesla I'd do a nice glowing blue effect across there and in the uh, energy cells across there. So that's just uh, Games Workshop Ice Blue that's been airbrushed on and the ends of the uh, actual Tesla weapon. Same for the one on the bottom. A little bit of a glowing effect put on there for the uh, Tesla so it shows up nicely and same with my um, Tesla armed immortals I've done them with a bit of glowing blue and once they've got a full 10-man squad knock in the camera I'll uh, put them up for you as well um, it is a lovely kit to build there's, uh, there's quite a few parts and it's definitely one of those that you really do need to paint in stages otherwise you'll never get at little bits like there and the power orbs in the bottom there. Um, so I will do a step-by-step -step build up until uh, um, well, up until when I get the um, command barge sorted for Amrakir, who comes out in the next couple of days. Um, I've used this in a game, and it's uh, it's pretty damn nasty. Um, the Twin Link Tesla Destructor is Assault Four. Or is it Heavy Four? It's it's four shots either way. Um, has the Tesla weapon, so any sixes to hit generate two automatic extra hits, plus the Tesla Destructor arcs to nearby units. So any root, any unit, friendly or um, enemy, enemy or friendly, it will even hit your own Necrons if you're not careful. Within six inches of the target unit, you roll a D6. On a six, they take D6 strength five AP dash hits from where the lightning just jumps across. Brilliant, really like that rule. Um, and it's got the little Tesla on the bottom. You can change that for, for Gorse, but the way I figure it, yeah, it's an anti troop weapon, this, so uh, give it the anti troop Tesla for a little bit of extra hit. Um, armor 11 all round, but with the quantum shielding, it goes up to armor 13 until its first penetrating hit. And under the new 6th ed rules, has three hull points, so it's quite a nice little, uh, quite a nice little kit. Handy thing to have on the battlefield, and um, I've got to say, I played a game against three of these, and they are just freaking terrifying to actually come up against. So that is my catacomb command barge. Command barge? No, I can't even talk today. That is my. Uh, Annihilation barge that can go skimming across the field. And it's snowy white base there. So, thank you for watching guys. Um, stay tuned, I guess, is the usual message. Uh, this is going to be one of the only non-Night Lord things for, for the foreseeable future. With the exception of the up-and-coming uh, release of Anne Rakir this weekend. I will be doing a video on him. But... Um, yeah, for the foreseeable future, it's going to be Night Lords, Night Lords, Night Lords, because I do have uh, an Apocalypse game coming up for them under Templar's um, pre-heresy tournament, uh, tournament campaign. So I need to get my uh, stuff together for that. So, 
it has been done. There are more projects coming. Stay tuned, guys, and uh, I'll see you soon. Bye.